Hey everyone, Ravikin here. Welcome back to Card Hunter. Last time, we did Mauve Magic Core number 6, which means we unlocked number 4, even though we had number 5 still. Um, we're gonna go to the Tomb of Tiverkis, though. Because... Okay. What happened? It's like a double click. Aw, I missed what Gary said. I feel sad. Can I, like, restart that? No. No. Oh. I feel upset. Oh well. Just got a diamond in his eye. Okay. The bones of the legendary giant Tiverkis, dread servant of the necromancer Eltza. Sure, I'll go with that. Have interred beneath the forgotten boneyard of Nazg. Hodeth. Is this the location of his treasure hoard? Through a secret door in the bottom of a coffin, adventure awaits in the tomb of Tverkis. Let's begin. Oh no. Karen losing her job is my fault. I wish I had never heard of Card Hunter. Dude, it's okay, Gary. She wanted this. The Graveyard. Legend has it that the entrance of the crypts of Elt Za is through a coffin bottom in the black mausoleum of Nazg Hodeth. A pail of unnatural gloom lies upon the boneyard. As you approach the mausoleum, the ground erupts. Zombies, fresh from the earth and emitting tortured groans, shamble forward to blah, 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 blah. Shamble forward to attack. <coughs> Adventure! Ambush. Nope. Neither of them. The zombies groan in agony. In fact, <clears throat> the zombies groan in agony as they stumble towards you, miserable and utterly dejected. Okay. Well, might as well prepare. Okay, so they can only move like one at a time. So, we need to. Force bolt! Um, let's walk up right here. Do a stabby stab. Followed by raging strike. Uh -oh. Come on up, my friend. Predictable stab. Quit trying to eat my brains. Turn around. Okay. Okay, Stout, you need to, um, take all those guys out. Good luck with that. So, what we need to do is, um, Able Stab. This guy. Uh-oh. Basic stab. Basic stab. This okay. And what do we got? We got Spear of Darkness, we got a basic zap. Let's do basic zap. Okay. They're getting they're getting here. Okay. And then what do we want to do? We want to not do anything. Right? Right. We're gonna move right here. And what's this do? Huh. Yes, I know. Enemy control card would be a tab blah 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 blah. We can do that. Okay. We do this right. Uh oh, that's her. Uh oh, heal stout. Heal stout. Okay. Well, we have 
no other choice. We need to face this way. And Stout's gonna die. Um, Arcane Spray. So I have screwed this up royally. Ember Spray. Okay. Well, move forward. Move forward again. Clumsy drop. And enter. Okay, stout. Please don't die. Okay, well. This is not looking the greatest. So we might as well do a what's this do? Each card on the target's hand. Oh. So that's gonna do nine damage at the depending on which one we're looking at. So we should probably I can kill this guy. Or almost kill this guy. <laughs> Ouch. Why can't you attack? Right away. Run away. Uh oh. Oh, it's because you got scared or whatever. not going the way it's supposed to be going. Oh, why did I even do that? Okay, so we need to do some massive damage here in order to make this work. So, let's start off with a sizzling bolt on this guy. Um... Cleansing. I didn't want to heal that guy though. That was not my intention. Big zap on this guy. Is that all? Oh well, this is crappy. Okay. Um. Burning fingers. So in theory, I can still win this. If I get the right cards. <clears throat> Which, at the moment, it does not look like I did. Try that again. That was me being. That was stupid. Of me. I divided my forces. Okay. Here we go. Sizzling bolt. Should we hold off on buckle bolt? I think we're gonna hold off on buckle bolt. Move forward here. Ok, 
Okay. Stabby stab. <laughs> Reaching swing. <laughs> Okay. And we'll do it this way. Finally buy a heal. There we go. So I have to make sure I do this properly. Um, do a strike on this guy. Do a um, zappy zap on this guy. Still out. This. Move forward here. Give me a draining touch. Back him up a little bit. I didn't want to wait. It's fine. I like that position there, we're good. We're gonna get surrounded, this will be bad. Okay. Start off with a heal. I can't heal. Oh. Poop. Okay, well, force blast this guy out of here. Lunge. Okay. Well, this is terrible. Terrible, terrible, terrible. You're gonna die, aren't you? Well, you can't do your attack, which means that you're useless. Wonderful. Give me a fragile curse on you. Give me a penetration staff on you. I now need to use an ember. Do that. Give me my bludgeon. Give me my bludgeon. There we go. Keeping yeah. like a double click going on. Okay. Give me this. So he's gonna die. He's just burning. Okay, do the heal. Okay. Get rid of dash. This is not going well. I need to get I think I need to get out in the open so running around is what it comes down to. Um give me an attack card. to do.
Oh no, I screwed up. Okay. Need Aura to get me out. Please don't die on me, Aura. You're gonna die on me, aren't you? You have one health left. Might as well kill this guy. You're gonna die on me. Okay, reaching swing. Okay, run over here. Twin heels. And around. Okay, we're gonna do the kiting thing. Okay, well. Fragile. Fragile. Followed by draining. Followed by runaway. Okay. Well, this is useless. Pass. What do we got? Pass. Perfect. Here we go. Okay, we got some. We got something. Okay. So I was hoping it wasn't gonna happen. We're fine though. We're fine. Everything's okay. I just don't have any attack cards. Okay. We're fine. Come on, give me something. Really? Kill this guy. And then we're going to Sphere of Darkness this guy. Then we're going to run as far away as we can. And pass. Thank you. As long, as, as long as I get them to run around in the room, I have the potential of just kind of winning it. Unless I don't get anything, and then there goes that. There we go. There's something. You, you're my target. over to me. Oh no, I went inside your reach. Whatever I'm gonna do. It's almost like I did it on purpose. There we go. Okay. 
Really? Okay, what do we got? Four, three. Fragile curse. Yeah. Followed by Spear of Darkness. Followed by... Run? I guess? Pin room. So they have stuff that's close. As long as I say at least two away, I'm pretty much guaranteed I'll be fine. Spear of Darkness. Run over here. Followed by over here. We're good. Um walk right here. Oh no, I moved inside. Whatever shall I do? Oh, I know. I'll stay two away. Okay, get rid of Nightwing. Come over here. Why is my mouse being so funky? Uh oh. Protective stab. Ow. I guess I can't do anything. That's not fair. Run away. Attack soldier. Limited heals? Nah. We're gonna pretend like we did something. We're good. Perfect. Fragile curse. Legend. Not how you're supposed to do that one, but I did it. All is quiet in the boneyard after your victory. You leave the zombies to rot in peace. You hope for good this time. What do we got? Cool. Ooh. Perplexing raid. Target cards a random card and loner. Take two physical magical damage for each character within two squares. This damage cannot be prevented by armor. Ooh. That's kind of upsetting. Cool. Oh. You probably didn't realize this, Ravikant, but Morvin was just me just me making fun of my brother. I had no idea, Gary. Mausoleum. Having dispatched the graveyard zombies, just slowly opened the door to the black mausoleum. Mausoleum. If you, if rumors are true, the stairway down to the crypts lies in the bottom of a large coffin. But no sooner have you stepped inside than a group of armored skeletons unsheathe their swords and rattle their bones menacingly. Oh man! Their skeletons. A piercing usually doesn't work. Undead come from the negative plane. Where everything is blighted and ruined. That's kind of sad, isn't it? Ooh, fragile curse. And uh, this one. And sizzling blade. A sizzling bolt. And then we're gonna move forward. And then do burning fingers. Okay. And then we're gonna go up here. Do a predictable stab. We're going to walk forward. And we're actually gonna do something stupid. Wait, and they're currently piercing and slashing. Oh, that was because I was stupid. Oh. 
Well, that was because that was stupid. It's fine, he should be dead. Kindler. Um, do silver bolt and light. Give me a scouting run. Just stay right there and pay for it. I just wanted to see what you guys had. Okay, what do we got? Okay, well, do this. Probably bad idea on the icy block, but it's fine. Because what we're gonna do is sizzling bolt on this guy. Ouch! Draining touch. Ouch! Fungal bolt. Um, twin heels. Big heels. Dashy dash over here. Run right here. Ouch. Okay. Not going the greatest here. Uh oh. Dissolve armor. And fungal bolt. Not today, boyo. There's only one of you. I can skirt around you all day. Wait, how do you heal? I don't know, but burning finger. And silver bolt. Take one damage, two damage. Oh, you're gonna heal. That's fine though, because you're dead now. Sacrificing my own teammates to win. The armored skeleton life shattered. The grinning skulls quit quite da, 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 da. Quieted. It. They supposed to be quieted by your weapons and spells. Now the stairway to the under crypts yawns like a black mouth to swallow you. Well, that's not good. Okay. Ooh. Acid spray and hot spot belt. That's kind of a cool little belt. I mean, I think what I have is better right now maybe yeah we're good though okay, oh dude. if i hadn't been so childish melvin wouldn't have taken his set away and karen would still have her job but then you wouldn't talk to her gary and how are you two supposed to get out get together i'd have like a card hunter wedding narthex the stairway beneath the coffin is narrow its walls slick with slime it winds down into the black crypts before emptying abruptly into a large high vaulted foyer. It appears that some undead inhabitants of the crypts, despite being long dead, have arrived to greet you, greet you prepared to face both skeletons and disgusting festering zombies. Okay. Who's one of these ones? So. Bit obvious. First thing to do is go there. Followed by here. Followed by 
you not being exactly where I want you to be. Okay, so... Do this. Ouch! Okay, so that's not far enough, so we're gonna do this. And then we're not gonna attack anything. And then we're gonna do strong stab on this guy. And then we're gonna do our Spear of Darkness. And we're gonna do a cleansing. Then we're back up to full health. And give yourself a block, just because. And round. Perfect. Everything is going perfectly fine. Okay, well, we're gonna start off with a burning finger. Um, do a stone spike. Give me a penetration stab on this guy. No. Oh, it is working right now. Sweet. Perfect. And health-wise, what's everybody at? Let's heal. And it hurt. He's dead. Two more rounds or two more guys? Whichever way it works. I'm okay with this. Okay. Well, we're going to. Oh, I can point. I can fire that guy. We're gonna wait though. Four. Reaching switch. Perfect. Reaching switch. Um. Stabby stab. Followed by burning finger. Take it up. And turn. Let's get rid of some walk cards. And dashes. We won though. Never mind. Gary, although you have wounded me, you were my sibling. I therefore feel duty bound to inform you of the following. What? Ah, stupid mouse. I've offered it as a prize to the first person I games and things to finish the campaign. I'm assuming all of this card hunter stuff. I have no doubt that you and Ravikant cannot succeed at this task, but you may attempt it if you must. <laughs> Whoa! Whoa! Gosh, uh. If we could win that ticket, Karen could still go to cardstock. Oh, no, she's giving his ticket up. Okay, I picked it up. Stupid mouse. How dare you double-click again? Skeletons. That trouble. The living are bad enough, but hope you've seen the last of those putrescent, festering zombies. More than likely, I'm not going to see I'm going to have much of the next uh, little fight here. Spiked heavy heavy? Ooh. So spiked. Let's um maybe do that. Ooh. Able bash. So when other characters die, you must discard your hand. That's sad. But simple bash, able bash, and a couple strikes. Ooh. That's a um a strong one. I don't know if that's something I'd want to do, though. I mean, I could switch out for, like, that. Ooh, ooh. For now, though, we're going to do this. And we're going to take this. And we're not going to do anything else. Oh. Jeepers, Ravikant. Will you help? Can you beat the champion before Melvin's friends do? Tomb of Tivericus. I don't know. It depends if I'm actually timed or not. Adjacent to the Burning Temple is a large... Buckler of particular... Opulence. A plaque above the door proclaims this is the resting place of the famous gigantic warrior Tivercus. Tivercus. 
perhaps disturbed by the commotion next door, the fleshless Tiverkus is risen to his feet, accompanied by an animated horde honor guard. Oh no, he roars in anger at your brazen trespass. Whoa, whoa, I don't want to fight a giant. Encounter. Tiverkus himself seems to sense a destiny within you and recoils from your powerful gaze. Or recoils from. Yeah, okay. So, in other words, he doesn't want to fight me. I'm okay with this. Okay. No, because skeletons can move. Like, there we go. Now that you've almost entered the zone of my trigrams, I need to do something. I need to go right here. So I can do burning finger. Okay. And then we're going to run up to right here. What we're going to do is stabby stab on this guy. Or, please don't do anything. That works too. And give me a consumption on this guy. And I guess we'll do this. Okay, give it a walk. Okay, here we go. So, Kindler. Give me a dash. Come forward. Ouch! You butthead. Okay. We could just kill that guy. Give me a draining touch on this one. Give me a big zap on this one. Give me a normal zap on this one. That's fine. There we go. Okay. So I have to take this guy out. He's gonna be the hard one. So let's focus fire. Sure. So get rid of this, this, and this one for now. This one, this one, this one, this one. Okay, what do we got? Pass. Fire fingers. Uh oh. Do anything, can you? That's bad. That's bad. That's very, very bad. He's immune to all poison slashing. Avenge me! I will try. Unfortunately, he's um a little punk. Okay, and power. We're then going to scouting round on this guy. And those are both a one. So, both. Come over here. 
Um. Go here. And row. Okay, and I'm assuming he probably doesn't have any more move cards, which is good. <laughs> really, even with all that, he still took... okay. Okay, and stone spikes. And I should walk this way. I think he should take some damage here. Whoa, 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 what about fire damage? Okay, so I got two characters against three. We got this. You guys are weaker. Okay, let's, um... Strong. And you're dead, so might as well try killing people. There goes me, um... Trying what I was gonna do before. Go here. Run all the way over here. Then stop. I stop. Curse you. Okay, well you did not give me anything that I wanted. This is bad. in the zone I want you to be in. Move here. Dang it. Let's screw that up. Okay, this is gonna be bad. I got greedy. Oh, wait, maybe not. Oh, I got so lucky. Whew. You will? Wow, thank you, Ravikin. Nothing can stop us now, not even a giant skeleton. Aftermath, the hulking Tiverkus, has now been put down. But though you've done the world a service, he was not your quarry. Or quarry. Elt Zav seems to have looted your grasp for the time being. Nevertheless, you, you help yourself to his treasure. What do we get? So, whenever you play a move card, add two to its move points. Does not affect. St That's pretty awesome. Healing dash and then sparkling cloth. We take damage from an enemy card. Move two. Ooh, that's kind of. Those are kind of cool. Treasure. Here we go. Ooh, mighty spark. Perplexing ray. Sorceress bolt and two basic spark. That's a pretty good staff. And shield block any. If this card blocks magic, heal 8. Ooh. Hit the deck, block any. Attach to self and halt. Duration 1. Hmm. Okay. And flimsy block. That's not a bad shield either. 
Let's see. Between the two shield users, this gives me lucky block, which are pretty awesome. And the unreliable block, which is kind of blah. The issue is I need a what should we call it? One of these. And like the boots and everything too. It's like she has like two seconds to get the boots on her. And that might be good. The question is should I put the staff on this one? So I can switch it out for that. Oh, I don't want to do that. At least at the moment. Okay, we're good for now. Sweet. Yeah. Karen, we're going to win that ticket for you. Melvin will give it to us if we can beat the champion. But we have to do it before anyone else. You rock! Wow, that's so cool. Let's play Card Hunter round the clock until we beat this thing. Oh, snap. Okay, well, the Citrine Demon Portal, I'm not high enough for. Shrine of Astral Guardians and the Jewel of Altza, which is the next one for this one anyway. Okay, that's just coming up. It's this level 10 tavern. And Goblins, in, or uh, Tree Forts of the Goblin King. Ooh, that's the next one. Let's take a look at the Song Sword Wood Tavern here. What do you give me? You give me a level 10 character. Okay. So if I wanted to change, like, um, races, essentially. I don't want to do that. I'm good. So next time, we're either going to do the Tree Forts of the Goblin King, or one of the Mob Manticores. Part of me wants to do one of the Mob Manticores, just because of, uh, now we're on the clock to finish as soon as possible for the, uh, you know, getting the ticket for card card stock. Just because it kind of makes me feel like a dick. But, at the same time, I really want to figure out what's going on with the, the Goblin King here, because I know that was one of the ones over here that we were dealing with. And then kind of get over to here, because this opened up four quests. Which is awesome, plus the locked ones. So I need to figure out when I can get enough pizza to unlock all that, but it looks like you need quite a bit. So I'm wondering if you, I don't know, if you have to pay for it to get unlocked or what. Wrong button. But it'd be kind of cool, like, just playing the normal game-wise if you would end up getting enough pizza to unlock it. It's just a matter of waiting for it to happen. I don't know. Well, thank you all for watching. I hope you guys had fun. I know I did. This game is amazing. It's loads of fun. The writing is amazing. I don't know. It's just, uh... It's just loads... As long as you're not taking it, you take it with a grain of salt, you know. It's just funny. It's a good game. Oh well. See you guys later.